Hey folks, this is Vince with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to quickly check out Merchant. This is a free-to-play game that you can find on Steam. I'm assuming it's on mobile too. It's got that mobile feel about it. It's an idle game, and there are no tooltips when you hover your mouse over these various buttons. In fact, it's very difficult to tell what you can click on and what you can't click on. Like, look at this for example, okay? Now, there are actually three different buttons on the very top. Uh, some may see it, others may not. This top left here lets you customize your merchant skin. You can buy more with real money, which I'm most certainly not going to do. Um, shop theme, again, you can spend real money, which I'm, again, not going to do. Upper right-hand corner, the little wrench that you can click on, you can mute the music, which I've done to prevent any sort of copyright issues. There's a mobile save transfer option. I'm assuming that means you can cross-play. Down here, social media buttons, nothing too fancy. Okay, so there's craft, stock, hero, and shop. At the beginning of the game, the game led me through a very quick tutorial. I got to choose a hero. There was like warrior, wizard, and rogue, something like that. And uh, they each had different stats, as one would expect. And then lastly, it took me to this crafting area where I crafted this potion. Uh, I also sent out my hero on a, a quest. So maybe we'll try that. Hero. So there's different different places I can send them to. But for right now, we'll just send them to the gathering. Uh, bushes don't fight back. Typical. It looks like there's the stats for this area. On the very bottom, you can go back with this golden arrow looking to the left. And this golden arrow looking to the right is the conf confirmation button. Like I said, it would have been nice to have some sort of text here. Okay or back, you know what I mean? But it is what it is. So now they're on a quest and they'll be done in about 10 seconds. Like I said, it's an idle game. Craft. Um, I guess we'll go ahead and... Can we craft that? We need some moss and some ash root. How many can we craft? I guess two. Alright, that's going to take 30 seconds. Our hero should be done. Earn some rewards. And these are the materials that we just used to craft those alchemy potions. Let's just keep doing this. Alright, so stock is your inventory. As you can see, this is what I have here. I can sell these things um, on the very bottom. Oh, see, this has text on it. This says sell. Why couldn't those other buttons have uh, OK or confirm something? Just weird. Like, I, I, I like that some mobile games are ported to PC. I just wish it was done with a better interface, more user-friendly interface. But that's just my opinion. Okay, I don't think we can craft that yet. Alright, shop. Use the sell menu to sell items for additional gold. Well, that doesn't help very much. Everything's locked. I can purchase slots here with gold, but I'm not going to do that yet. Okay, I can hire a hero for 500. I might consider doing that. Gollum, um, can we fight this yet? I'm not sure. We'll find out. If the warrior comes back and he's... It, I, it looks like we got raided. Um, like with a grade, A or B or C, depending on how well they did. So we'll see how that goes. Looks like we're done. Yeah, see, here's this B here. So it looks like we're, we're raided on that. Select an... Okay, we don't have any more... Items, I guess. Let's try uh, selling these potions. Okay. Higher hero. So there's warrior, rogue, mage. There's also down here berserker unlocked at level 15, warrior, uh, cleric is unlocked at level 15, mage, assassin unlocked at level 15, rogue. Further down, paladin, dark knight, and bard. All right, so let's do a rogue, I guess. Ah, oh, Moss Golem was defeated. Good for us. 
Oh, I see. So these potions that we're crafting, I guess we have to give to the warrior as it takes damage. Okay. Although it didn't look like he was injured here. His health is at 130 out of 130. Oh, you can even click on him and, and equip different things. Worn Helm. Okay. So it looks like there is an RPG-esque element to this that I didn't see before. The tutorial was extremely brief. And here's the purchase store. Uh, not going to do it. Experience boost, speed boosts. Again, you can spend real money. I'm not going to do that. Let's send them out. We can attack the golem again. And now we wait. Use this screen to view all known recipes. Be sure to come back as your crafter levels for new recipes. Yeah, we need more ash root. There we go. We leveled up. We gained some materials. Send them back out. Looks like we're getting a lot of rock from this, but we need more. And it looks like we can only assign one person per area, too. Send this guy back after the golem. Ah, oh, what's this? Sold for 82 gold. Selling to... Oh, so when we sell items, it takes time for it to actually occur. Interesting. I thought that money exchange was instantaneous. Again, this is stuff that the tutorial did not cover whatsoever, but... Alright, back to gathering more goods. Our warrior is just having a good old time defeating these rock golems. Let's try the treant here. See what we get from that. Alright, there we go. We'll craft... Looks like we can craft three of them. Looks like we can make one of these. Woodworker, we can craft one of those. Armor Smith, we can craft three of those. Iron Ingot, we can craft three of those. Okay. Busy, busy. And it looks like these recipes level up as you do it too. So you'll be able to unlock more. Yep, now we can make boots, for example. Guess we'll craft a wand. Ice. Okay, so I think you guys get the idea. Um, there's no screen resolution options or full screen options or anything like that. However, you can resize the window whenever it comes up. I've got, I just hit the maximize button on the window when it, it blew up on my, my screen. So, um, while there's no screen resolution options per se, you can adjust the window to your preferred size. All right, Merchant. Again, free to play on Steam. If you want to check it out, go do so. This is Vince. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.